One of the features inside of the Easy Attendance app, which is quite useful, is the custom statuses that are present. Now, a status is considered any of these different criteria that you can use um, to assign to a student during the attendance taking process. By default, these are the four statuses which are included. So the present, absent, late, and excused statuses are automatically included. However, you can actually create your own. Now, these are things that apply directly to your class or your particular situation, and they just give you a little bit more customization on um, what exactly you can put down. So to add a new status, click the button at the top, and we might say, um, well, if I could spell, excursion. Now, this is obviously a status that you can put on, um, and then during your attendance process, you could apply this particular status. The option here that says treat as miss gives the user the possibility to either um, count that towards the absent total. So if they're on an excursion, then they're not in class, so we'd probably keep that to treat as miss. If, for example, they are late, then we don't necessarily want that to be kept or um, added towards the absent count, so we keep that one off. And the same goes for no gear, um, we'll treat that as miss. So you've got the customization to even um, drill down a little bit deeper um, to work out exactly what these count towards. Now one of the things that you can do here is you can tap and hold on a status to set it as your default. So for me, my default status is present. So I actually have all students default to present and then all I have to do is just change the um, students that are not present. But to change any of them, I just basically tap that status and hold it in and it says, do you want to set this as your default? And if I say yes, then now late is considered my default status. Now if I go back, um, you can change that to set as default so that present is. One of the other features that you can do is you can note here that my absent is in red and so is my excursion. So if I tap on um, edit and then tap change color beside excursion, I can change the color to anything I like um, just to make it a little bit more likely that it's recognizable um, as compared to its other statuses. So there you are, Excursion's got a customizable um, feature. So there's our statuses, and you can see that if I go into, um, let me just add a quick course here. Go into PE, I can import from a CSV, a class. Let's just import this test class. And if I go into take the attendance in my test class here and add attendance today, if I tap on it, you can see here that um, these are the statuses. Our default is shown. It's currently set to present for all our students. Um, but we can change them by sliding them across. We can just base, we can just tap on them if you like. That's a little bit quicker. And you can see excursion is the one that we um, we added previously and it now reports um, as absent. So there we are. Hopefully that gives you a little bit of an understanding of the custom statuses that are present inside of the Easy Assessment app. Enjoy.